There is no way a kid is going to pass up on candy, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> to get us into the spirit of Halloween this morning, there could be some permanent guests inside the Fabulous Fox. Our Sydney Stallworth takes us inside the theater for another installment of Spooky Spots. Do you like to watch the shows here at the Fox? Oh. That's a strong yes. <laughs> yep, that's me using dowsing rods to talk to ghosts inside the Fox Theater. Now you may be wondering how I got here. I know I am. But nothing could have prepared me for this. So I've seen one spirit but felt countless. So rumor is there are ghosts inside Fox Theater. Some have been here before the main stage was even built. And we captured our one of the best apparitional shots I've ever seen right here in seat H11. And it's a lady just sitting here like she's watching the show. And we think this goes back to the McClure family who had a mansion here at one time. Some spirits like Anna sitting up high in the mezzanine. She was the caretaker for the church that used to be on this land, the Grand Presbyterian Church. And people describe her the same every time. They're, I just saw a lady in a green dress. Seeing the theater with the house lights on is enough to take your breath away. That's if the spirits who live here don't take it away first. You could see the ghost of a maintenance person who walks up and down this hall jingling his keys. One of my investigators snapped a photo over here and they captured his apparition and it's pretty amazing when you see it. Strange happenings in the tunnels underneath the stage. I've walked through here with mediums before and one gentleman literally keeps his hand out because there's so much traffic. He said the hallways are filled with people in costumes and overalls who are working the show with lighting people and they're just constantly coming up and down the hallway. Arlene says two employees came into this dressing room. When they tried to leave, the doors were locked shut. They started to scream for help. The master key, which is, works everywhere in this theater, couldn't get these doors open. Finally, the maintenance man ripped the doorknob off this door to get the girls out. It's never been put back on because they swore we're never doing this again. Fox Theater has brought in experts like Dr. Mark Farley and countless mediums to find out which spirits are living here. We've been able to communicate with so many that they'll tell us their name. So we have Jeffrey, who's probably our most popular one. Another spirit isn't as friendly. William, the poltergeist, lives up in the projection room. He's super strong, he's super powerful. Anna and a few other spirits decided to show up for our interview. Do you see Sydney? Will you point them at her? My hands aren't moving. So you know I had to try this for myself. They'll cross them for yes and they'll do this if they want, if they're saying no to me. Okay. Are you guys friendly? Do you like to watch the shows here at the Fox? Oh. That's a strong yes. <laughs> I'm really not gotta, moving she's it. She's not. I'm you really not. Your elbows would be like a chicken. Yeah, you I'm really it. not moving it, Joe. It's crazy. It is okay. It's insane. Next time you see a show at Fox Theater, come with your eyes and mind wide open and look beyond the lights on the stage. You may just see something you can't explain. With your spooky spots, I'm Sydney Stallworth, five on your side. <laughs> so we're having a discussion up here about whether or not any of us have experienced any mm -hmm. type of spiritual. Mm -hmm. Monica says yes. Yes, mm -hmm. and you have as well. Yeah, right? yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I love Michelle. She's like, I want them to yes. visit. They don't visit me. Come okay, on. please come visit. Just don't be creepy. Come on. Be a nice Best girl line. like Casper. Right. Yeah, <laughs> <Casper>. <laughs> I would uh, like Casper to come to the uh, uh, Stay where you are, ghost. Yeah. Maybe you'll have a little Casper this evening for trick-or-treat. <laughs> yeah.